Hi, I'm Andrew Amps, preaching minister here at the Farwell Church of Christ. I want you to think back one week. Right now, as I'm speaking, it is Wednesday, March 18th, 2020. One week ago, the kids were going to school. We were having meals in restaurants. And I was planning a sermon to be able to preach to some of you. And then on Friday, everything started to change. Classes for students got canceled. Restaurants closed to dine in. And we had to suspend church. We have now seen that it is going to be necessary to suspend our Sunday gatherings for an indefinite period of time while we seek to be a part of the global strategy to combat the coronavirus. It's going to be strange. It's going to be weird. It is a big adjustment to all of us. One of the things that we're going to do here at the Farwell Church of Christ, like many other congregations, is we're going to try to provide you with some solid teaching right here online. And if you're just joining us, we want you to, to uh, know what we've been doing this year. Throughout all of 2020, we are seeking to read through the Bible together. This week's readings come from Deuteronomy 17 through 34 and Psalm 91. We would invite you to download a copy of the Bible reading plan that we're using from our website, and that'll break it up into just a couple of chapters a day for you. As you seek to adjust to this new lifestyle that we have, we would invite you to do some Bible reading each and every day, to get a dose of truth and a dose of hope from our God and our Lord Jesus Christ. Then on Sunday, join us so that uh, you can gather some more information from sermons as we seek to unpack pieces of these scriptures that we've read through the course of the last week. Most of all, we want you to stay healthy, stay safe, but continue to grow in your faith during this time of unusual experiences. Keep coming back here to uh, the church's Facebook page and or to this YouTube channel in order to stay current on events that are happening here at the Firewall Church of Christ. Stay safe, stay healthy, wash those hands.